Hello everyone, Nurko here and welcome to the 29th episode of my Iron Man series. This episode I'll be preparing for Elite Diaries, so I'll be skilling a little bit, I mean a lot. I'll be getting my Herbler up, my Thieving up, my Agility up, I need, I'm need. i gonna get 94 Magic. I'll be getting 80 hopefully Runecrafting, so it's gonna take me a really while. And the first thing I'll be doing this episode is collect my resources, but there's a twist. I will be not taking any wood. I'm going to take everything on mining, just to see how long I can get it. Everything is still going to stay on herbs, so let's see how much I can get, Let's shall we? 10,000 coal, that's amazing. I need that. It's a shame for all the bird nests I miss, but if I really want bird nests, I can I can kill mole very easily. So if I really need nests, I can do that. So what I get else? Uncut sapphire, emeralds, ruby, diamonds, heralander, staromins, cantadine, iron leaves, lantadimes, dwarf feeds, aventos, squarms, rainars, toadflex seed, five guams. Two parental seeds and one iron seed. Not bad. Not bad at all. So, yeah. I'm gonna leave it on coal for a while. Just because I need around 55k coal for all my um, ores. And that will give me 85 smithing. Like, right on the edge of 85. So, it's gonna be a while before I get that. So, yeah. Um, I'll be doing... I'm not sure what I'll be doing next, but yeah, I'll see you in the next loop, guys. What I'll be doing now is just all all my non rune rune items. So I'll be adding, uh, alking my bows, my battle. I will alk my battle saves, but I'm not done yet. So I'm keeping all my runes until I'm 99 Slayer, and after that I'll be um, alking everything else. I also need to alk this because I have no cash at all. I have 59 coins. Yay! So I will I will get about think 76 agility and 94 magic. So I'll see you when the level comes. And here we go. 75 agility. Should be getting it right here. 75. I can now boost for the Fremnic elite, but I'm gonna go uh, a few more levels because I have a lot of alking to do. So I'll see you at 94 magic. Let us get 94 magic, shall we? Here we go. 94 magic. I can now cast vengeance. I can now do ice barrage. I'll show you right here. So ice barrage right here and lunar spells. Vengeance. That's so sweet. Only two more to go until I can cast every single spell in the book. I'm really glad and I will see you at the next level. Ah, uh, 84 crafting, thank you very much. I can now make black dragon hide armor and onyx bracelets. Like I will ever do that. God darn it. Who the hell makes onyx bracelets anyway? 84. Only 6 more levels to the fury. That's gonna be a pain. Anyway, I'm almost done spinning all my flex. I have about... I think I have about 1k left. I need about 20k until 85 crafting, so I won't be making that. So here we go, 1.6k to go, and I'll be doing something else, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure what. Could be fire making or thieving, although thieving is very easy, and it's this can be done in like a few hours to get to like 80 or something like that. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna quickly do that, and I'll see you in the next clip. It's been a while. I just I said I was gonna do thieving, but I'm gonna get 75 rune crafting first. But here is 73. Only two more to go. I really want to get this large pouch. Uh, yeah, a giant pouch. I had to get my large pouch from Abyss again because it's destroyed in what lies below. No, it's not what lies below. Ah, uh, fuck. Devious Mines. That's the one. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. And. Spix is getting 99 farming right now. Congratulations, man! He did it really fast. <laughs> I was I was almost not ready for the recording, but yeah, 
He's doing damn nice, but he's he's a Zulra prod. Anyway, he has like 4.5k kills. I'm gonna ask him later on. And let's get the K put him. He can't wait at all. <laughs> can't even spell trainer. <laughs> oh god, what a man, what a man. Uh, this means he beats the uh, DIY farmer. The reason why Spix is getting like 99 farming, like he rushed it, because DIY farmer said he sucked and that he wouldn't get it before him. So Spix uh, just got it, like rushed it as well. He he's been a, he's been slacking a little bit because he has work and stuff now. But yeah, congratulations! He's gonna show off the cape that he's buying right now. Look at that cape. He will be do the emote. Damn, this is going smooth. Like I'll ask him how many what's the Zulra case he has. Because as you know, Zulra is epic. It has the best drops for Iron Man. And he has, see he has four point five K. That's that's a lot man. That's that's amazing. Anyway, Gretz again spixed. Here we go. 74 rune crafting. I can now craft two chaos runes from each pure rune essence. Very nice. And one more level to my pouch. That's my goal for rune crafting. If I get 75, I will be training something else. But yeah, that's another 114k XP. So that's a whole day of rune crafting. <sighs> it takes me a while. Also, I'm training farming while doing this. So. Getting closer and closer to my first spirit seed that I can plant, so I can't wait for that. Anyway, let's keep on moving on. After a long grind, I'm quickly going to get 75 rune crafting, which means I can now use giant pouches. That took me a freaking while. So uh, I'll think I'm gonna take a little break from rune crafting and get my thieving up because it's an easy toss, uh, easy skill to train up and I need it for my elite diaries for desert I really want to get the achievement diaries like the skills done for uh, Fremenic and desert just because of those rewards and I really really want those so I'm sitting at around 120k more pure essence these will be all used up at the end of the episode so I can start episode 30 with no pure essence at all, like with one for a bank space, just to see how much I can get. So yeah, uh, I'm, I'll, I'll quickly do some thieving, and I'll see you at the next level, probably farming, which is very close, or thieving, depending on how my farmer goes. This pet should give me 83 slayer, yes, uh, 83 slayer, I mean farming, a little bit sick, but anyway. I can now get spirit trees, plant them and get more XP as well so it's gonna be awesome it's a long way until 84 but yeah I'm very glad of that level and I will see you guys in the next clip here we go first evening level of the video 73 easily I'll see you at the next level here we go 74 oh crap I failed awkward here we go 74 thieving I'm not sure how far I can go because this is very fast I can easily get like 90 in 3 days, so I might as well do that. I might get 91 and just get it over with, so you'll see. This is going too fast. Um, I just leveled as well, like you saw that. But 120 million total XP right there. That's a big accomplishment, and I'll keep going. Da -da -dun. Right on time for 75 thieving. And this is, this is unbelievable. I always fail like this. Come on, don't do this to me. Yes, here we go. 75. I can now get, I can now steal from gem stalls and pickpocket gnomes. Very nice. Damn, I missed it. 76 thieving. And also, the war ended like a year ago for my total level, 1945. If you get it, you're smart. If you don't, please pick up a book. Please do. Anyway, let's keep on going. Here we go. 77 thieving. Four more until I can get to the next room. Very nice. I feel like a criminal stealing everyone's heart. Kappa dog. Let's go and get 78 thieving. I can now steal from rich chest in Dorgish Khan. Very nice. This skill is really a steal to train. Haha. -ha. 
And here we go, 79 thieving. Two more to go until a new room. This is really go this is really going fast, so yeah, I can't really complain. And also, 121 mil total. Very nice. Opening these doors should give me see 80 thieving. God darn it. I cannot pick it pickpocket from heroes. I have 1950 total. Holy crap. I'm 50 more until 2k, but yeah, it's very high. And one more until the next room, and I really, really like this skill. I wouldn't do it at the Gelfites or Menophites, Menophites for Blackjack, because that's just boring. And I will show how much Scarabs and Gold Seals I will have at 90, 91 thieving. So, just to, to give you an estimate on how much money I will make from this, because every seal is 750 cash, and every Scarab is 1k. So it's easy money and it's really fun. And it's also always also fast XP. I, I'm getting 100k an hour, so I'll be 81 in two hours, which is very nice and very fast. And also my total XP is going ex uh, high, very uh, up, very fast. And I can't speak anyway. I'll see you guys at the next level. Oh my God, I did it! Holy shit, I found the Pharaoh Scepter. Oh my God. <laughs> This is amazing. I didn't even expect that. Holy crap. This is going to be awesome. This is really awesome. This urn here, right here, is going to give me 81 thieving. Let's go. 81. Next room. Thank you very much. This urn is giving me 82 thieving. Thank you very much. Two more levels in until the rogue chest in the wilderness. Lego. Lego. Another thieving level, if I don't fail. I swear to god if I fail that was bad. Anyway, 83 thieving. One more until I can do the chests in the wilderness. Very, very nice. And 8 more levels until I'm done with 4 desert elites. Hopefully I can get loot from this. It doesn't take me. Yes, here we go. 84 thieving. That means I can use the chested rogue to, get, uh, to have a chance for dragon stones. And one more until I can pickpocket uh, something else. But we'll see in the next level. Here we go, 85 thieving. I can out thieve elves, very very nice. Only six more levels to go until I'm done with thieving for a while, and done with pyramid pyramid plunder for desert elite. So fucking glad. And that's back to the rune crafting grind. Hooray! I'm failing at 86 thieving. Fuck's sake! Come on, let go. 86 thieving. Thank you very much. I just got my second pharaoh scepter. 86 thieving. Holy shit. I didn't expect it either. God damn it, I'm lucky. 87 thieving. Very nice. It happened again. I got another Pharaoh Scepter. And I'm close to 88 thieving as well. I was not expecting it. was like. Uh, when I was looting the chest, I was like, oh, I'm outside again. What? Why? <sighs> anyway. That's another one to the collection, I guess. This door should give me 88 thieving. And this guy is just telling me that I'm still here. It's really funny. So I was like 86 or 85 when I met him. And he watches my videos. So thanks for watching my videos. And yeah, I just got 88. And I'll see you at 89. Or at 84 farming, I guess. It's either one of those two. Here we go. 84 farming. I cannot get quadruple Jurus. Jurus. Not bad. And also almost 90, 1960 total. Very nice. 89. Oh fuck's sake. Come on. Don't be screwing up now. 89 thieving. Two more levels to go until I'm done with thieving. For a quite while. And then it's going to be like 4 hours a level. So 9 times 4 I guess. 4.99. It's really fast. 960 total as well. Very, very nice. Didn't fail, so here we go. 90 thieving. One more to go. One more. The moment I've been grinding for for a long time. Here we go. 91 thieving. This means I can now go to the last room for Elite Diaries. So it's gonna be awesome. Holy shit, I'm glad. I'm gonna show you the loots I got from nine, uh, 73 I think that I started to... Yeah, see this is the lag that I deal with sometimes, it's really annoying. It doesn't even move. 
for long. But yeah, I'm gonna show you the loot I got from 73 to 91 in a bit, so I'll see you then. So these are the gold items I got from 73 to 91. 1,349 gold seals, 7, 722 gold scarabs, and 139 gold statuettes. So let's see how much money I can get if it works like this. I have some interesting... Yes, show me the money. 1.9 mil. 1.9 mil, so I'm gonna quickly go to Edgeville. Because it's not the only thing it, I got. Uh, lag. This is every single time I teleport. And I've, I have no idea how, what it causes as well. So there we go. One scepter, three scepters. So in total, I got 11.7 million. And with the new construction update, these will go up like double the price or something like that. But yeah. On to the next grind, I guess. Boom! 76 rune crafting. 5 water runes from each essence. Only 6 more to go. Let's go! And 100, 107k essence to go. I'm currently going to get my resources to get more coal because I want to train some smithing to get my fetching up. I'm leaving rune craft for a while because it's a bit a bit a little bit annoying. So yeah. Ooh, I still have 1.7 mil around there in my kingdom. So let's quickly get it. Collect resources and I'm also out of cash. That's, that's the reason why I wanted to do fetching. So 6k coal, uncuts, tyromins, aventos, heralander, 27 rainer weeds, cantodyne, iris, dwarf, lansdyme, and rainer seeds, nice. Anyway, on to the next clip. I missed it, but I just got 80 smithing. I'm not sure what I get from that. So let me check quickly. Element Bell Lexus. And also a huge a huge shout out to True BF. You get instant bars, that's so amazing. So yeah, thanks to the, to the guys in the CC. I'm getting a lot of XP, and I will see you guys in the next clip. Here we go. 81 smithing. I can now make adamant chainmail bodies. Huzzay. I don't really need, I'm not really going for that, but anyway. I'm about, with my bars, I'm about uh, 10,000 dart tips down. So, um... I still got some mithril bars and hoping to get 83, uh, 85 fletching from there and we'll see in the next clip. And the clicking begins. Here we go, 83 fletching. This is gonna be awesome. See you at 84. 84, one more until I can get my mage longs into magic longbows. I think I overcalculated as well. 85 fletching. I can now make make magic longbows. I don't know where I did I did wrong, but I'm gonna quickly finish these off, and I'll see you at 86 fletching. I wonder how far I can get, but yeah, here's 86. Ta da! Let's get 87. Right on time for 87 fletching. Yeah, boys, I still have a long road to go. 12k, well, 13k to go, so yeah. I'll see you at 88. 88 fletching, hell yes. Let's get 89. And also, I'm getting closer to 2000 total, which is very, very awesome. Also, past 128 total XP. Let's keep going. And here we go 89 fletching. This is going pretty well. I have to put in like another 200 hours in this episode before I want to end it, so it's going to be awesome. And the next episode is going to be even better. That's what I know for sure. Anyway, let's get 90, or next 90 level. Very nice. I'm getting another 90 skill. Here we go. 90 fletching. I can now make dragon arrows. I have enough for about 92 or 93, so I'll see you at 91 or at 85 farming. Let's get 91 fletching. Hello. I can get like 93, so... No, 92. That's gonna suck. 
I have almost 11k left to go. I think I'm gonna finish with broad bolts. I mean broad arrows, since that's about 600k an hour. Well, that's, that's what Spix says, so yeah. I'm gonna get 95 through that, so I'll see you at 92. Let's get to milestones right here. 85 farming and 130 mil XP. Very nice. And now I can grow torsos. And I completed a elite task and 1975 total. Wow, that's a lot of one clip. Holy crap. Well, hello there. 92 fletching, which means I'm at the halfway point to 99. And it's gonna take me a freaking while. So yeah, uh, this is the last level I will get this uh, fletching from my logs because I'm way low. So after that I'll be doing uh, agility and fire magic, so I'll see you then. Whew, that's, uh, this is gonna be another level, I hope. Yes, there we go, 76 agility, four more to go, and I can now use the island crossing near Zulandra, very very nice. This took me a while, but yeah, let's go. 77 agility. I can now use the Shiloh Village River Crossing. Very nice. And this is really taking me a long time. Three more levels until I go Releka. Let's go. One mage level coming up. 95. One more until I can do Spellbook Swap. Very, very nice. Uh, let's get 78 agility, shall we? Yeah, of course not on this jump, I meant on the end of the route. Here we go. 78. Nothing special, but two more until a relic, of course. And uh, let's jump down and get our 79 agility. Also, a quick note, at the end of the episode there will be a... Um... Something I, um, I will be talking about, a... I, I, I forgot the word. I knew it before I was going to say this clip, I suck. But yeah, there's going to be a announcement I really want to make. So be sure to look at, um, to l look at the episode at the, until the, at the end. And I will see you guys in the next clip. Now for the last arc. I did like 1k arcs without doing agility because I really was... I, w I wanted to get over it. I got 203 marks of grace and 9 29 mil. 29 point... 29th mil, 154k, uh, 600. The reason why I wanted to get over it because today is the 21st of October. Tomorrow should be the release of the pets. So I really, really want a Chinchompa pet. So that will probably be me, me doing that in the next clip. Or I can do Kingdom first because I think I'm almost out of money. So yeah, that's the plan. And also. Tomorrow is my birthday, so pets are coming out on my birthday. It's really, really awesome. And I really hope to get a Chonchonpa pet on my birthday. That'd be such a good present. Anyway, see you guys in the next clip. So, the uh, this is, today is the 22nd. As you see, the my game update has come true. I'm really, really, really disappointed that it's not pets, uh, the skill pets, to be honest. I really was expecting to to be able to hunt for pets again. I'm really disappointed, but yeah. What can I do? I guess it's next week along with Deadman mode, I guess, but that's really weird. Deadman mode and skill pets on the same update. But yeah, that's that's how Jagex plays it, I guess. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna just buy more jugs, because I want to get food for episode 30, which is gonna be a special episode as well. So yeah, 500 more jugs and I'll be done. So I'll see you at my cooking level or herbler level because I'll also doing be doing Herblore. Yay. I fucked up. It's 87 cooking, but I'm not even done yet. I lagged, and yeah, that's one 882 wines made. Still have to make 4.6k. This kind of sucks, because I want to do it in one big XP drop. Okay, please kill me. I'm not going to kill myself. I'm just a moron. <laughs> anyway, in the next clip. I lagged, this is so horrible, but yeah, 89 cooking, 1984 total, and I still have to do 880 more grapes. So I don't think I'm gonna make 90, doesn't really matter, it's a nice goal, and I'll see you at the end of this grapes, wine, whatever. These are my last wines, so let's see what drop I will get, it's only 894, but I don't really mind, 
So let's wait for the XP drop. Should be coming any moment right now. 178k cooking. Very, very nice. Anyway, uh, next thing I'll be doing is, I think, getting resources for Herblore to make potions. I'll be using all these wines on the future episodes, so this is going to be really, really fun. Anyway, see you guys in the next clip. Medium clip from Cockatrices because I'm getting limpet roots and I got an ancient crozier. That's one part of the headband crozier done. Holy shit. I'm lucky there. Let's get 84 defense. Yes, and also 134 million XP. This will give me 1985 total. Getting closer to the 2k. Not sure if I'll make it, but yeah, here's 84. Still 114 combat. Yeah, let's go. Oh my god, I finally got a headband. Holy shit. Damn, that's very lucky. Now I got a headband and crozier, so I don't need to drop the clues anymore. So freaking glad right now. Crap, I missed it. 85 defense and 115 combat. Hell yes. I'm now gonna train strength until I get all the limpet roots. Time for another level. Here we go. 80 herblore. Thank you very much. I cannot make ranging mixes. Like hell I will. Uh, whoopsie daisy. 81 herblore. Sarah Bruce. Thank you. Let's get it out of herblore level. Here we go. 82. I can now make super weapon poisons. Like hell I'm ever gonna do that. Probably never. Anyway, let's keep on going. And this will be the last and final herblore level. 83 herblore. I can now make magic mixes. I wonder what's at like higher levels. Because I'm at the last page as well. So one more level until extended fire potions. I need four more until anti venoms. And seven more until super combat. So that's going to take me a while. But I'll get there. And let's see where I'm going to end. I decided to do some cooking because I need food. So yeah, here we go. 90 cooking. And that's the last cooking level of this episode as well. I might go for 90, 92 total because that's the year I've, I'm born in. So yeah, that's one more level. I'm not sure what I'll uh, get, but yeah. I'm going to finish off with these sharks right here. I won't get 91 cooking too bad. I'm like 200 sharks shy. So yeah, see you in the next level. Let's get this 90-92 total level. There we go. That is my year of birth, so... Yeah, today is the 30th of October. And I should normally end the episode right here. So I'm just going to do an ending clip and I'll see you guys in the next clip. I would like to thank all of you for watching this video. And I'm really sorry for it taking so long to make it. Um, the reason for that is I really don't have much time anymore. I'm really caught up with personal life and I try to play as much as I can, but still. Uh, I think some of you are wondering how I look like, so there will be a Gyazo in the description of a picture of me. So that's kind of good for you guys, I guess. Uh, if you, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to make a special episode 30. It's going to be awesome. It's going to take me a month or something to like... Um, to complete that because I have a lot of goals there but it's gonna be amazing so for the people who are really wondering what I'm doing in real life uh, I'm currently doing a I don't know what's it called like I'm trying to like tests to do uh, to get into police school and yesterday like the 29th of October I had my first two tests and the first one was like physical test and I passed that with like ease and the second test was the thinking one. I'm not sure what it's called in English. So, And I know those uh, results in two weeks. And I train a lot to get to, through those tests. So that's why I can't play that much. And also, I have to do shit in real life for my dad. Because uh, we have a oven, or whatever it's called, with wood. And that heats up our whole house. And yeah, we do a lot of that for that as well. So, long story short, I'm I'm trying to be a, uh, like I'm trying hard to be a cop, like a police officer, 
and I'm training for that. So I, I go to the gym for 10 hours a, uh, 10 hours a week just to get fit for uh, all the tests. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time.